Hello, I'm Paul Hillier and I am Artistic Director of Chamber Choir Ireland. And I want to tell you a little bit about uh, a series of four concerts that we're presenting over the autumn of this year, 2018, into the spring of next year. Uh, we shall be presenting the complete motets of Johann Sebastian Bach. Um, in each, each of these four programmes, they will then be contrasted with music by other composers from different epochs. And in fact, I'm calling this series Before Bach and After, because really that's what it's about. We're going to be performing the motets with just an organ and a, uh, a bass string instrument and the singers. So as far as the Baroque uh, era is concerned, this is what unaccompanied choral music consists of. In the first programme, which we're doing in August and September, August in Kilkenny and September in Dublin and elsewhere, we shall be including music by composers who were in a collection that we call the Old Bach Archive, a collection made perhaps by Johann Sebastian himself, um, possibly by his father or other people of his extended family of musicians. So it contains music that they, first of all, that they could use uh, in the church services. They didn't only perform their own personal music. Uh, and also, of course, compositions that they liked uh, or which they found interesting to, to study. Um, the first piece we'll do is, in fact, part of the Missal Brevis by Palestrina, which is going back at least 100 years from Bach's time. Uh, this exists in what I would call an ed edition by Johann Sebastian. There's not a great deal of change from the original, um, but he has kind of adjusted it to his own aesthetic ideas. So we'll begin with that. And then there'll be some other motets from that same collection uh, from composers a little bit older, a generation or two before Bach himself. And then in the same program, um, remember that the title of the, the whole series is called Before Bach and After. The old Bach archive is obviously before Bach, but after Bach comes Brahms, um, which may be a surprising composer, but he, um, in the middle of the 19th century and the late 19th century, uh, wrote quite a lot of choral music himself. He was... Um, a choral conductor in the early part of his career, which is why perhaps he wrote uh, motets and part songs um, for choir, choirs to sing. And in particular, the motets are very fine pieces and they clearly show the, the influence, strong influence actually, of Bach himself. Um, the funny thing is you can see that, but it also sounds very much like, oh, this is music by Brahms. It really is a marriage of the two things. And as I say, in both of these concerts, the first one and the last, um, motets by Brahms, as well as Bach, will be featured. So if you like the music of Johann Sebastian Bach, and I've never met anyone who doesn't, um, I do hope you'll be able to come to one of our concerts. There will be several sprinkled all around Ireland, starting in August of this year and ending in the nearly in the summer of 2019.